Welcome to my channel Living Linux. Someone asked me if I could test Renoise on a single board computer with a Rockchip RK3588 and a Raspberry Pi 5. So in short, Renoise, well at least to me, it looks like an old school music tracker on steroids. Um, I didn't really investigate it much, but yeah, that was my first impression. So Renoise is available for ARM64. So that's the version that I downloaded both on my Racha Rock 5A and on the Raspberry Pi 5. Uh, I didn't install it, um, and when you start it, without installing it, um, yeah, you can see that I don't have the real-time priority thread for ALSA. Um, so that means that when you run uh, Renoise, um, it's probably a good idea not to run anything else in the background. So let's see, we'll go for the demo song Deep Blue Tension. So here it is. And we'll start playing. And here it says that it is measuring the CPU load, but I don't think that's correct. Because if you look at HTOP, here it says that it's almost 50%, but looking at HTOP, it doesn't look like that any of the cores are actually hitting 50%. So um, perhaps it's because of the big little architecture, the Rockchip RK3588, it has big cores and little cores. So four big cores and four little cores. So Adam, I'm not really sure how this is supposed to sound, but it sounds okay to me. And I think the Rockchip RK3588 still has a lot of uh, headroom uh, from the CPU perspective. my mouse pointer so let's uh, go to the Raspberry Pi 5 So here we are on the Raspberry Pi 5. Um, I did try to run it with Ubuntu, but it sounded a bit weird. So yeah, Renoise, it's probably better just to use Raspberry Pi OS for the time being. Perhaps um, it will be fixed in the future. Who knows with uh, Ubuntu 24.04. So 
So here we have deep blue tension again. And here you see that it's reporting a much lower CPU load. And well, to me, it looks that the Raspberry Pi 5 is a bit more efficient. But since the Rockchip RK3588, it has the four big cores, just like the Raspberry Pi 5. But it has four additional little cores. So I think all in all, uh, well, I wouldn't be surprised that it does run a bit smoother on the Rockchip RK3588 because a program like this, uh, it can really make use of a lot of threads um, so that it scales really nicely over more CPU cores. But I think both the Rockchip RK3588 and the Raspberry Pi 5 that... Uh, well, it looks like they can play Renoise. So, that's all for now. And I hope to see you again in my next video.